kidnapped me and used me as a hostage in like a laundry. Oh. And um, then they claimed that I wasn't kidnapped. Right. Yeah, and that I'd went with them willingly to like give them a horoscope. I mean, so what, they're trying to downgrade it to unlawful imprisonment? Yeah, I don't know what they were trying to do. You know what I mean? We'll be good. Nobody's here. That's unfortunate. Waiting game. I feel like they're just literally doing it to prove a point. That's it. That's all they're doing. Sorry. Yo, what's up? Um, at the LSPD. Why? We're waiting to see if um this is gonna get trialed or not. Whether they're gonna drop it. I got you're gonna give me a what? And I gotta act really sad. Okay. Why? That's not sad. That's angry. Because I she's abandoning me. She's not allowed to do that. No, she's not allowed to do that. It's like, I will kidnap her and I, no, fine. And say that, you might get arrested. <laughs> Sorry, Reggie said, don't do that. You might get arrested. All right. <laughs> That's okay. I'll tell her I'm going to kidnap her out, out the front of here. See if they do anything. All right. I'll come over. We're gonna go make someone feel guilty. Hello. Well, careful, guys. I might kidnap you, you know. Hello. <laughs> it's a long read, so I hope you can read fast. Hey, you bro? Oh, you know, dealing with cops doing dumb things. Damn, Top things fucking dumb, yeah. Thanks. Whatever you do, right. Atlas, don't give that book back to Amori. I was just waiting to see whether or not they're going to be dumb enough to charge them with felony obstruction of justice. Felony obstruction? What the fuck? Yeah. Yeah. Because uh, the cops broke off a chase for this. Oh my god. Ain't no way that they think that that's felony obstruction of justice. That is the fucking wildest thing I've ever heard. It's crazy. Is this the Schwarzer? It is, yeah. I'm going to get some uh, bars. Oh, nice. See, I could understand misdemeanor to a degree. However, um, ultimately, it was the cop's choice to pursue that further. And the fact that the cop stood there and said, you don't think I would do this helps our side for that. When it shows that the cop's intent I mean, wasn't to, to save the person, I don't think he is. it was to prove a point. I, think I don't think he's awake. Shit. Good. What do you mean good? I need to tie up loose ends before I leave. It's it's gonna be like good. a dick move if I just leave without telling people. That's yeah, why I had like good. letters made for everyone. Where's my letter? Yeah, I'm writing. I was gonna write it, but you took the fucking book. Didn't this fucking escalate? <sighs> I was gonna talk about you know how we met. I you know, totally said. At the gang. Well, I'm gonna write one right now. I have like five books on me. All right, let's start. No. <laughs> Do I need to kidnap you? Getting them out of the chase, yeah. It's like a cop trying to charge someone with misdemeanor obstruction of justice because they crashed into the car accidentally whilst they were doing a chase, right? There's a, a lot of different charges. False reporting, I think, would get put through. Right? Um, I think false reporting would land. I don't see a judge saying it's felony obstruction of justice at all. Walking. Keep going. No, I'm not. I'm 
wanna go. I need to go talk with. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go finish this journal in peace. Come on, Arlo. Come. Don't worry. I will hunt you down. So you know. <laughs> Which one was it? Abdul. Oh, it's wider than I can tell. Come on, four seven. That'd be this one. I don't have Terry's number. It's okay. It's my uncle. Quick, get, 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 get the eighty. Can we go on your number? I'm the ultimate thing. Hi Abdul, are you going to pick up Omori? I... I will pay you double to not pick her up. Are you? I will Abdul pay. Right now? I will pay you double whatever she was gonna pay you. We're two hundred and sixty-five bucks on me right now. I'll pay him that. As well. She gives. Okay, she gives him five hundred usually. Okay, um, Jason, you want to split half? Five hundred. Huh? Yeah. Fuck yeah. You give okay, Jason and I will split half half. We'll pay you five hundred not to pick her up. What do you mean? I'm gonna pay him 5k then. Well, okay. She wants to leave. She wants to leave the city. She she wants to leave us all. That's not nice. What do you mean that's not nice, Arlo? Leaving people who care about you behind. No, um, but so we're like with her now. I mean. Yeah. Are you oh, getting in the Jayden. cab with me, guys? Yep. Okay. Jason, we're gonna pay a, if. Wait, wait, no, no. Actually, I don't want to. I'm already here. It's come over here. Come over here, Jason. Okay. Bye bye. She's threatening to pay him five. Hello, Reggie. What up, man? Hello, Carrie. How you going? Uh, it's good do to see you. Do you need like more fur or anything? Or are you good? No, I'm just waiting at PD because PD decided that they wanted to be dickheads. Okay. Hey, what did they do? Arrested Billy. <laughs> Oh, I tried calling Billy. That's yeah. why he wasn't able to pick up. We tried to, um, we we're dropping him off somewhere and he was in the trunk. Pop uh, bumps into mm -hmm. us uh, and um, we were just parked at the lights. And then he yells out that he's in the trunk. Be careful. And then she says, are you kidnapped? And he's just like, oh yeah, I'm kidnapped. And then she's, I'm just like, don't act like you're going to do anything. And she said, you think that I'm not going to pull off this chase to, um, for a kidnapped person? And I said, no. And then she decides that she's going to pull me over and then they felony stop us. Now they're charging him with felony oh, obstruction of justice because they broke off the chase. For yeah, then why do you care about me? That's huh? crazy. Yeah, it's fucking wild. Because you were the first one to wear nice to meet in the city? No. Not felony so obstruction gonna, like, of justice. Dispute it? Or not? Yeah, I sent someone in to go help him out. Oh, okay, that's good. Yeah, I'll be shitty Dude. if you're like fucked over, over something like that. Over, over a fucking joke, right? That, no. that the cop says first. Yeah. Fucking wild. All right, cool. Um, yeah, I, I was just wondering because we did a bit more hunting, so I thought if you need anything else. No, nah, we're good for now. All right, cool, 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 cool. cool. All right, well, uh, oh. hopefully all goes well for Billy. And, uh, yeah, we'll see. I'll... I mean, he did double See's down, tomorrow. so he kept saying he's kidnapped afterwards. So. I mean, you know, he's just going with the joke. Yeah, nothing wrong with that, to yeah. be fair. I mean, it, it was nothing hostile in that whole fucking situation. The fact that we're sitting next to her while he's saying that shows that he's not fucking kidnapped. The fact that we didn't run shows that he was not kidnapped. 
Yeah, but no, we'll I see. guess the cop just wanted, you know, to... Oh, no, they wanted to prove a point, 100%. 100% they wanted to prove a yeah. point. So, yeah, we're going to see where this goes. All right, well, good luck. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow. All right, bye-bye. Have a good one. What's that car doing? Is that red car slowly creeping forward for you two? Um, the one that's parked? Yeah. No. For me, it slowly keep, creeps forward, then goes back again. Nope, it's sitting still for me. Thanks, man. Oh. Fucking. <laughs> Jason, you fucking asshole. What uncles do that's not what uncles do last time we if you're taking him. if you're taking to the hospital you might want to let abdul know have a good sleep yeah, okay. i think he was coming here to pick her up is that fucking angel okay i'll ring him and let him know is that just angel that walked in It's Atlas again. Um, Amori's not gonna. She's she's not gonna need a pickup anymore. She's she's had to take an emergency visit to the hospital. I, I did nothing. Um, it was a little bit of tough love from her uncle. Yeah. A little bit of tough love. Um, I'm actually, I actually. I actually have no idea what happened. It was like behind some trees, but yeah, she's she's headed to the hospital now, so she's okay. But thank you so much. You two have a wonderful day. Uh, it's tiring. Um. Welcome to the PD. Oh no, I meant that in the, the the PD stuff wasn't tiring. It was more of the I just like being more to them. stuff. Enjoy yelling at them. Cuz they don't know what to do. Oh, I'm not going to talk to you till you calm down. Did you actually think I'm fucking wilding? I can actually do it if you want. Oh no. I don't think I could be the explosive type. I like doing it just for fun. How I get my kicks. I got my kicks out of them apologizing. I just I I just can't see inside my head where they thought that the fact that we complied the whole fucking time why they thought that he was still kidnapped when they oh, had no. confirmation from him saying i'm not kidnapped they still thought he was kidnapped and there was no threat yeah. of violence at all there was <sighs> guns out they were ready they were that was the dumbest thing ever though like if we refuse and they shoot into the car, they would be shooting into the trunk too. Hurting the person. And if they hit the wrong part of the car, like... I don't fully know how guns work because I'm not really a gun person, but couldn't, like, if they hit the bonnet, could there not be, like, a possibility that ricochets back or would it just go straight through? It'll be straight, I don't know straight through and go under the engine block. Oh. And then it blows all of us up, right. Yeah, it won't, it, it won't it won't really blow us up right they'd have to hit the they'd have to hit the fuel pump and that kind of shit pierce that and then cause an ignition from there okay not a gun person just didn't they make that fucking so dramatic for no reason holy shit that escalated i I felt bad because I was like laughing way too much. 
kind of fun there. Watching them like be super duper 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 antsy over like absolutely nothing was kind yeah. of fun. Yeah. Listen, that, that shit usually happens around me when it involves cops. I like to escalate it. I like to prove a point, puff the chest out. Mm. I love how the cop was just like, did she have her lights and sirens on? She had her lights on. <laughs> well, she had her sirens she on, she was in the chest. No, because we were talking to her without having to listen to Yeah, that's what I thought. Now, here's the other point, right? How are you aware that someone's in a chase because they have their lights on at an intersection? You don't. Because police do that all the time. Maybe just she to had go her through. lights on for us. Well, it's, it's not we were suspicious it's not even that right like we've seen it countless times where cops will just blow through red lights with their lights on and then turn them off again there's no way for us to know whether or not someone's actually in a fucking chase just because there's a cop in an area where more fucking sirens are happening and you don't know where they're fucking happening you, you can't inherently know that that's a chase and then then let's bring on to the the point of Billy's in a trunk where he can't fucking see. Mm. So he definitely doesn't know. Correct. No sirens. We could have been fucking with him for all he knows saying he knows saying that there's a cop. Yes. And then if they were gonna try and charge me with uh reckless endangerment by having him in the trunk, there's already a case that went through but taken to the docker with uh KJ. But they tried to charge him that, and uh, he got off it. Also, I swear, after you just said about the cops going through the red lights just with their lights on, just for the sake of it, I swear out of the corner of my eye, I just saw that happen. Oh, it always happens. <laughs> just funny timing. I just hope he's not dumb enough to plead guilty to anything. Surely he's not though, right? It's Billy. He pled guilty to trespassing a roof when he was doing roof running. When they were, um. it, it's an accessible ladder to the public and there's no sign stating you can't be there. Um, does he have like a lawyer in there or? Yeah, I sent a paralegal there. So surely he'll be like, Fine. So it's just hopefully more a matter of whether they drop the charges or whether it's a bench trial, right? Yeah. Okay. Like, I can see a judge allowing false reporting to stick. And the felony obstruction or any kind of obstruction of justice is dumb to me. See, now if I was in Billy's position, uh, mm -hmm. I would have just played dumb in the fact that I was in a trunk. I didn't even know that was a fucking cop. Yeah. Then what? What are they going to do? What are they actually going to do from there? And the paralegal thought of that and told him that. Ah, uh, he would have already said something to bust that out. Oh. Billy. Something dumb.
That's why we're not waiting here forever and we find out soon. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking. Waiting to see if we're needed for something or if Billy needs a lift. Does it usually take a long time? I don't know. Sometimes, hard to tell. Hmm. I wasn't sure if I saw uh, one of the judges walk in there. It should be wild for PD to do if the, the word bench trial was already thrown around, is to pull a judge in to check charges. Because then that's just taking a judge away from being able to take a bench trial. <coughs> That'd be a very cunt move. But from what you've told me, that's kind of right up the alley, right? Yeah. Yeah. Do you have run-ins with cops often anymore? No. Oh, no. See the old cops? They knew that it wasn't worth their time to argue charges with me. <laughs> if they tried to pull me over, it was just, a, just not worth their time. I once held a cop at a traffic stop. Uh, I think it was for nearly fucking three hours. Because they were too stubborn to go. And I told them that they're free to leave. They told me I'm free to leave. And I told them I don't need to go anywhere, but they're free to leave. Eventually he, had, he left. A good time. I'm a very stubborn person when I want to be. Sounds like you want to be stubborn most of the time. No. Having poor Petty off? Yeah! Just when people do dumb things like this. Seems like a lot of people do dumb things. Oh, they do.
gonna go check the newspaper. Oh, nothing. Just waiting game. No. Yeah. Tried to call the um paralegal to see if there's any update. Nothing. No answer. Which judges? I'm sure. Maybe Norman. Yep. <clears throat> it had to have been the lawyer that left because there's no other cars here. Like the lawyer that you called had to be the one that just left? Yeah. Unless yeah. they got dropped here. Maybe. Well, they were already here? I don't know. Could be. But then they'd have a car here still too. True, didn't think of that. back memories yo you know anyone else who wants a schwitzer no how much are you selling it for from me 95k that's it no one's yeah. buying it yet crazy nope. yeah i know I've been summoned, I don't know why you're not. Come anyway. They don't know my name, they forgot to ask. Bro. <laughs> they forgot to ask my name. I told you, I literally was like crying. I wasn't, I was fake crying, but. Every time they got close, I told them to go away. I'm having a breakdown. <laughs> and they just left me alone. Where are you going? 
you guys up to? This poor room. Short? Oh, shit. I'll try to get another idea at some point. You probably should. Yeah. Second, right? I'm pretty sure. Hey. Hi, we're in the bench trial at the second floor. Uh, the officer, Heisty, is insisting on not dropping the stupid charge, and we may consider calling you as a witness. Uh, our first strategy, though, is... Oh, my God, this guy's yelling. Our first strategy, though, is just having the officers go up there and seeing if they even meet the burden of proof, which I doubt they're going to be able to do. I'm okay. very sorry, Dingo. I did... I did oh. It's okay. I'll Bye. take them on. Bye -bye. Look. It's me. I'm still in disguise. I'm wearing a mask like Bingo because I'm standing tell. in solidarity with him, man. I can hardly tell. What's going on? What's cooking? We're about to do a bench trial if you'd like to sit in. Oh, yeah. I can do that, man. Oh, great. Hello, Your Honor. glasses back on so nobody catches me lacking. Good idea. Am I okay? Am I okay to wear my mask to cover my scarring? the judges allow it uh what's wrong with your fucking face man and that's why i wear the mask okay well yeah but like what's it what you got going on underneath it like yeah, you got like some that. fucking Thank joker you, I shit it. like i prefer not to talk about it Bingo, that's not appropriate oh uh both of us are here if you need to call both of us too that's not appropriate at all he feels me Expressing concerns about his insecurities. Well, I, I was expressing concern and curiosity about what the fuck you got going on under that thing. Well, you know, sometimes you got to be a little bit more polite when you're talking to people, you know. Like I can't just, I can't just look at the at a police officer and be like, you know, why do you look like an old fuck loser? You know, that's not appropriate. That's, that's rude. Well, it's also getting straight to the point where you get to skip out on like the mumbo jumbo and all the politics and you know the filibustering. That way you just find out what you need to know, man. Like, why the fuck are you so stupid, you know? That's what you gotta ask yourself sometimes. Is you gotta be like, hey, man, why are you so dumb? And then they answer, and you're like, well, now we know the answer. We didn't have to get from point A to point B, man. I suppose you're right. I suppose you're right. Abba Abdul. What is this case all about? Uh, this case is about... I don't know. Hi, Abdul. Oh, that's pretty cool. Hello. Hello. Double check there. Uh, what up? Is there a report number for this? Hoggy, okay. bro, I came here to you know spectate. Who's the lead officer on this? Is it uh, Denzel? Yes, it's, Your Honor. Uh, it's yeah, it's uh, I'm tra I'm the one charging him, Your Honor. Yes. He's the lead. Okay. Is there a yeah. report for this? Uh yes, there is, Your Honor. Uh, give me one mic. I just gotta finish up the statement. Okay, yeah, once you finish that up, make sure that you share it with the uh, attorney here as well, okay? Oh, thank you so much. What's a mic? How do I, uh, I don't know. I don't know why mics now? they're asking uh, to like, deal in people. How many mics for a, for a drink? I think mics are a police unit of regimen, you know? Yeah. Well, I thought they were like... Kind of like how some people, oh, yeah, uh, you know, measure their dicks in pinky links rather than... Yeah, I got five mics and, and I got five mics under my pants. <laughs> Yeah, I can fucking tell. You human trafficking under all those fucking clothes, fat ass? Hell yeah! You heard it. Absolutely, you can't be human trafficking in a courtroom. Yeah, but you, you, nobody else heard that? I mean, there's a lot of voice traffic going on in here. Nobody's concerned that this guy's actually skinny and he's just got like 10 people he's human trafficking under that? I, it might have been a joke, Bingo. Get Bingo. Crazy. Crazy. What might be a joke. Crazy. Crazy. Interesting. Yeah, they can take that joke. Interesting that they can take that joke. Ain't no way. Oh, now we got beef. Now, now we got beef. Now, now we're gonna get to the root. Of, there's gonna be some drama, and I can't wait for that. Okay. All right. Well. Keep it civil, okay. That's wild that we just had a perfect example just then. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was 
<laughs> Joe didn't even know, and he set it up perfectly. <laughs> I think we can have a seat over here if you like on the left. It's the witness time. Also, let me get this report. We're gonna I'm a witness. To, uh, You're a witness? Do it on our, on our own too. Yeah, I'm witnessing so, everything that's happening right now. Let the judge oh, okay, know what well, okay, that's fine then. Yeah. No, I don't want to sit in this fucking chair anyway. I want to sit right here. I can't believe that we had a perfect example what just happened. The hell was that? Tennis racket? Yeah, well, uh, you know, I used to be quite athletic, you know. I used to go around and hit the old pave. You ever heard of Wimbledon? They used to call me Wimbledon, man. What do you mean used to? You still got it, I'm sure. I'm retired. Yeah, I mean, we can do a poll if Billy gets charged with felony obstruction of justice or not. Fuck it. You know what? I'm just gonna lean But right not a poll of fucking Gamba. Ugly fucking chair. That's a good idea. I have never been more excited for a court case than I am right now. Yeah. I All feel right. like this is going to be entertaining. Uh, would you tell me the defendant's name? Uh, Your Honor, it's uh, Billy Thorne. It's it's Billy Thorne? Okay. Yeah, that's me. Okay, cool. Uh... Oh, is anyone doing it? So I can give you the report. Oh no, we share the reports via MDT. Oh, do you? Yeah. So you just Abilene Consalto four eight six five state ID, and then also please share it with the defendant as well. And we're gonna need a minute to review this. Okay, no worries. Back up. We need. We can. I'm gonna put these. We can send these reports. No, nah, not a poll. If I can. Yeah. Um. Yeah. But just do it over. If Billy gets charged with felony obstruction of justice, for Gamba. Oh, I can't do that. It's just a yes or no. He gets charged, found guilty of felony obstruction of justice. Bottom? Easy. Oh, uh, your honor. Yes, man. I believe it's the judge who is able to share the report no, you, with the counsel and it. defendant. You got to do felony obstruction of justice. Okay. He might get um, misdemeanor. We're just awaiting waiting. that. Okay, cool. Redo it. Redo it. Redo it. Thank you. Felony obstruction. Yeah, your honor, do I send it to you? Because if he gets misdemeanor, uh, then he still gets obstruction. Yeah. Can I just fucking refund it? We're good, yeah. Uh, yeah. Just, just tell me the report number. Three nine four two. Okay. Uh, what's your state ID? I'm actually talking to her. So I, she's the one who needs. Four eight to six five. Your honor. And what's your state ID? Okay, it's been shared with you. Six four five nine. The defense. Thank you, Your Honor. So they get felony obstruction. Yes. So it's Perfect. Four, five, now you just can gamble. Yes. Gamble away. Okay, uh, it's been shared with both of you. They should contain all the evidence and statements. I love it, Art. Uh, I'll give you guys a few minutes to go over that before we start, okay? Thank you, Your Honor. Stop gambling. Hello, Denzel. Hello, Abro. I feel like this has the most entertaining audience. I'm not what happened. I'm gonna go to jail for a very long time, Selim. Oh hell no. Hey, hey Mr. Arbery, listen. Um, Where did go? Where did you get that? I would like for you to be a witness in our yes? court trial. Yeah, where'd you get it from? What did you do, Abdul? What did you do? You don't want the answer. We've seen your buns. I can't say, bro. You have to no. say what I say. Oh, oh. 
I just waited for no. it to be unoccupied, and then I received it for myself. Oh, okay, I see. And you received it upon your head. And I received it, and now I wear it as a crown. I like it, it's good. Thanks, man. I want my own crown. But, uh, you, need to you need an arm so first, David. I have one, but it's being repaired right now. Yeah, How are you getting your arm repaired? Is it a prosthetic? Isn't that illegal? What? No, it's not illegal to have a prosthetic arm. Are you sure? Calling yeah, the person I'm pretty sure it's like a big them? crime here. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm like, I'm like 100% sure it's like a huge crime to be a, a prosthetic. Your honor? Excuse me, uh, yeah. All um, right. Uh, one moment, one sec. Uh, so, they attach a photo that's not... Oh, that's pretty good. Photo. How'd you lose your arm? In the war? Oh, which one? The dangling where I got blown off by an RPG. Oh, this shit! You were in the sh holy the shit! Small world. That was in the Sanguine War. Wait, you were? Yes, man. Oh, I, I yeah, he's a Sanguinian. This fucker. I yeah, I was on the Sanguine Isle, running around with an RPK, hitting massive flags, blapping everybody, man. Yeah, that's not. That's. Well, I'm a uh, your, your honor. Yes. Oh my. Uh, defense counsel would like to know how many, uh, witnesses prosecution intends to call. I... I don't know how many because we haven't really made any statements as such. How many witnesses are you guys going to call? Is this Denzel? Any officers listed on this report? I'll, I think... I'm sure I'll be on the stand and then okay. I think he's calling one more to see if they'll come. Denzel's? Uh, hey, from I have I have one more witness coming down here also. Okay, so it's gonna be is it who is it gonna be exactly? Uh it's gonna be uh Aubrey Webster. Okay. So Aubrey Webster, uh her and then you, the three witnesses. Yes, that uh yes, that that would be perfect. Yes. Okay. Also, uh your honor. Mm -hmm. Uh defense would like the motion to strike the photograph in the report. It's a photograph of a Lampadati, which had nothing to do with the defendant. The defendant uh was never in any sort of Lampadati. Uh, Your Honor, uh, motion to strike any Lampadati um, in this court case. Uh, Azul, are you on the prosecution no, side? No, no, no oh, yes, he is I not. Yes, I present the police. <laughs> oh, he is yeah, not, Your Honor. No idea what he's doing. He is not, Your Honor. He is not representing us. Abdul, you might need to step down then. I feel like he might do a better him. job. Uh, Damn it! So you wanted to. Abdul is kind of involved in this. For, for what reason? Because it's irrelevant, Your Honor. It has nothing to do with this case or the client or uh, any allegations against the client. Uh, Your Honor, that is uh, it's very relevant due to the fact that this is what was the reason. These are stolen goods that were chasing that uh. The original vehicle for so it is very relevant into this case that's why he's getting tonnage obstruction uh your honor i believe officer shicey when he's referring to original vehicle he's saying not the vehicle that had anything to do with my client okay uh, i understand what you're getting at um i'm going to deny your motion and strictly because uh this evidence can be used to build up a potential larger for your case their case so it well, may not be strictly relevant to your client uh, immediately. That could potentially become clear in the trial. So. so is there any other way to make that assumption? That you heard the cop trying to get someone in as a witness How for the case, you? and he said something about we came. How far are you? Okay, uh, How far so do you know how long Aubrey's going to be, Denzel? Um, I'm asking him right now, Your Honor. Yeah. Uh, how Listen, brother, we are waiting. Who the hell is Aubrey? Uh, forehead. Like Drake? There is no Drake. We Who's that? Yeah. Drake, no John. Time friend. We call him. Uh, call him uh, one more minute, my uh, your honor. Okay, one more minute. You know, my nephew uh, was shooting uh, RPGs. Defense, are you guys saying? happy with the time we've had to prepare? Uh, we've adequately had time to prepare, okay. your honor. All right. Uh, then do you think the duel we'll is just going to get to stay there the whole case? Abby will start yes. in, in due time, unless you're going to start it. with him. Denzel? Uh, negative. We can start with us uh, first, okay. Your Honor. And buckethead. Awesome. Is totally right. Well, Perfect. we'll go ahead and call this court in the session. Uh, welcome everyone. Court is now in session. We're going to be uh, overseeing a case for Billy Thorne. Uh, there's two charges that I'm seeing here on the report. I'm assuming that these are the charges that you guys are pushing, and that you don't. Yeah, want don't underestimate the THA. That's not wrong.
Hey, from hey, that is a charge. Okay, let's do it now. It's too late. Uh, so Billy right. Thorn, I have two charges here. I'm directly speaking to you now. Uh, for the first charge of false reporting, that. how would you like to flee? Not guilty. Okay. And the second charge of felony obstruction of justice? Not guilty. Okay. Not guilty to both. Don't try anything, you bastard. Here. Okay, uh, and then everyone has had time to review the evidence, so it should be good here. So we're going to start off with the prosecution. Uh, I'm going to have you guys call your very first witness, um, whoever that might be. Uh, I'm uh, prosecutor is going to call uh, Officer Maxwell, uh, Haley Maxwell, to uh, to go first. Okay, Maxwell, if you would please take the stand. Ingo, would you mind swearing her in? Yes, man. Oh my God. Hey, man. A joke that going. went too far. You swear to tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the goddamn truth. So help you the king of kings, the almighty King Glamesh, personification of Fingal Dan's ego. Hey, speak up, Haley. The hell did you yes. say, lady? I said yes. Yes. All right, cool. Yes. Okay, Haley, are you going to be providing a direct narrative, or are you going to be getting enough questions? Uh, I'm going to be giving the narrative. Okay. All right, you can begin. Yeah, uh, I was in a pursuit after a red lamp dotty. Um, I ended up driving through near the hospital, doing a turn. And while making the turn, um, I made contact with a vehicle stopped at the red light. I stopped to ask if everybody was okay, if they needed anything. And then I heard somebody talking kind of muffled, um, like like from the trunk. Um, and and I then I, I asked if they were okay, and then I somebody stated they were kidnapped. So I asked again, you know, are you serious? She left out the whole bit um, where she said, are they kidnapped? Which, they, they, I got out of my vehicle. I, I remember getting out of my vehicle. Um, they never stated they were or were not serious. So I, I said, well, if somebody's kidnapped, you know, I'm going to deal with this. And she I never got out of her vehicle. Her, uh, since the passenger was a female. She didn't. Um, what? Stated that I was too busy anyway. So it I wasn't going to deal with it. 20 minutes ago. How do people Something along that those lines. I, can't remember I don't know. Please. Words. And I which I obviously called BS because I got on the radio and stated there was a potential ki kidnapping and that I would be breaking off the channel one to pull this vehicle over. Um, I asked them to pull over. The driver said they were pulled over, which they weren't. We were in an intersection. And we ended up pulling over to the city hall. Again, at no time anybody's telling me that somebody isn't kidnapped. Um, the driver no backs they the were. car in, gets out of the car. I yell for him to get back in his car. I wait for officers to arrive. We perform a high-risk stop and uh, get the driver out of the car, um, taking very small steps backwards to me. Taking a lot longer to detain the driver than it really needed to, to be honest. Eventually get him detained, the female passenger as well. Before she got out of the car, um, somebody yelled that that she had a weapon, possibly. Um, again, I don't know if it was which guy screamed that, but somebody stated she had a weapon. We got her out of the car, eventually got her detained. Wait, who said anything about a weapon? Backwards, so Billy did. It was obvious. Oh, my. He was like, yeah, well, she's got, got a weapon. Yeah, she's yeah, got yeah, a yeah, weapon. Yeah, yeah, the funny like, thing Billy out of the vehicle and eventually fuck up. detained and questioned him. The fact that they At no time that did anybody that. state that uh, it was a, a false kidnapping the entire time that I made contact with him. Are you kidding me? I need to believe that, you know. Mr. Thorne was being kidnapped at the time. Holy and shit. I was too busy to actually deal with it. What a that bullshit. I don't even know where I'm at. Yeah. It's okay. Absolute it's okay. bullshit. You tell them everything. That's everything that you have? Yeah. Okay, Defense, do you have any questions for her? Uh, yes, Your Honor. Uh, officer, okay. uh, the pursuit of this red lamp Dottie, did that vehicle contain a defendant? No. 
Uh, what vehicle did you make contact with at the red light in your testimony? Black two-door vehicle. Uh, where is that vehicle right now? In the owner's custody. What kind of contact did you make when you said you made contact with it? Objection. Um, she crashed into What's the objection? It hot? Relevance. Okay. Uh, do you have a rebuttal? I do have a rebuttal, Your Honor. This is highly relevant in her own testimony. Um, she starts out with a red lamp and dotty, and then through her own volition, stopped to quote unquote make contact with another vehicle. And I want uh, the term contact expounded upon because that's going to build our foundation, Your Honor. Uh, if that's the case, then I'll object again. Then uh, it's uh, asked and answered. She said, uh, she said she already she made contact with him by asking uh, if they were okay. So it's already been asked and answered, Your Honor. Your Honor, misstatement of testimony. Okay, all right, if you stop that now. I, I'm i going to overrule your objection. She has not asked specifically, this question has not been asked and answered. The contact was expanded upon, or not, has not been expanded upon. The fact that contact was made was established, but not the kind of contact. So I'm going to let her ask the question. Hey, from. Uh, you can go ahead and answer the question. Yeah, so the first contact was I guess our door is rubbing oh, side by side, right? <laughs> and the second contact was me asking, are you okay? Please remind me if I ever crash into anyone in the car. The door's I rubbed. To say the door's uh, rubbed. When you asked, are you okay? Uh, did you receive We ran into our car. Somebody was already saying something before I could even really get that out. Again, I heard somebody talking muffled. And then I heard kidnapping part and I kind of stopped me in my tracks. It's not even what happened. So you stopped to interact with the vehicle before you heard anyone from the vehicle. Right, because I bumped yeah, into so them when I was turning. The seat. So, so did she bump into us or did she sure rub in rub okay doors? For safety reasons. <laughs> the doors just had Okay, a understood. Could you um expound upon what type of bump into the vehicle? Objection. Asked an answer okay, again. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sustain that objection. You've already asked this question. Officer, do you know who mentioned any kidnapping? No. Uh, officer, who is the driver of this vehicle? Reggie. Been around, huh? And where is the driver? Right there. Uh, you mentioned officers got Billy out of the vehicle. Uh, I'd like to ask, how did officers get Billy out of the vehicle? By popping the trunk and getting him out. And officers had to do this. Is this correct? I don't know the specifics of how they got him out. Because I was dealing with the female. Is it I worth mentioning that they the went fact that he to told you the trunk, to get out of the car, the get in the car, get out of the car, get in the car? He got out. I don't Ooh. know if he pressed the button or they. It's not really worth it, but yeah. It's not worth it, but it was just. Just funny. a circle back uh, to when you mentioned uh, you heard the term kidnapping. Uh, had anyone ever addressed you as officer and followed by reporting any kidnapping? Ooh. I mean, I was in a police cruiser, so I don't know why they would address me as officer, but um, I heard I'm being kidnapped. Well, if we're... Did they even answer the question. Uh, if, if we're assuming, but she said that she as you stated, heard. the defendant was a man in a trunk, um, did this trunk have and windows? She that she heard Objection. Relevance, Your Honor. Her testimony is changing. Uh -huh. Do you have a rebuttal? Uh, yes, Your Honor. Uh, I, I think a an assumption is being made by the witness that um, the defendant would have inherently even uh, known there was an officer there from the inside of a dark step trunk. Uh, okay. Um, could you repeat the question again so I can hear it? Uh, officer, did this trunk have windows? Don't answer that. 
I'm, uh, I'm... Don't answer that. Um, okay. Ooh. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna sus sustain that question. I don't really think that's gonna apply here. You can move on to your next question, please. Hey, Officer, no is it possible the defendant, uh, did not see anyone from inside the trunk? Yes, it's possible. Thank you. Uh, defense has no further questions for this witness. All right, thank you. Uh, did you want to cross? Yes, uh, yeah, I, I, I do, uh, Your Honor. I typically don't allow that, but I'll allow it for you. Oh, uh, okay. Thank you. I appreciate you, Your Honor. Thank you so okay, much. You're very welcome. I appreciate it. Uh, <clears throat> um, uh, Officer Maxwell, uh, during pursuit, what, uh, how do we drive our vehicles when we're chasing a suspect? Mm -hmm. Objection. Yeah, what's your objection? Relevance to this case. Uh, well, uh, it is relevant because I would like to to make sure that uh, there's no doubt that the individual in the trunk did know it was an officer on the outside, and uh, that's why I want her to answer this question. Rebuttal that would how be. Does, how does um? Yeah, how, how does the, how the police drive in a pursuit relate to him knowing? Uh. Really missed. Anyone can steal a cop car and turn the lights on. Okay. Yeah. Can I? Am I allowed to say something? Oh, just wait, just wait, just wait, wait, wait. Uh, what was the question, Your Honor? I'm so sorry. You're the one who asked the question, then. No, 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 because you, no, you just said something. I just like, um, oh. I'm so. Sorry. How, yeah, how, how would uh, that question specifically expand upon what you would like to find out? Okay, you're right. You're right. I'm gonna scratch that Did question. I, I, yeah, you're right. You're right. I'm, um, uh, Ma Officer Maxwell, do you have a history with uh, Billy Thorne? Yes. Objection. Relevance to this case. Ooh. Okay, how is this relevant, Maxwell? Uh, it's relevant because as soon as he heard her say, uh, are you guys okay, Billy Thorne was then, it, it was time for him to play fuck fuck games, Your Honor. Excuse my language. Objection. Uh, prosecution's rebuttal contains speculation. What did he say? An inflammatory okay. language. Uh, listen, we're, I'm not going to play this like uh, objection game. I understand like what you want to do here. This is a bench trial, and we do have other witnesses to get to. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to overrule the objection. I understand where your points are against it, uh, but mm -hmm. I'm going to let the question go through. All right. Uh, can you answer this question now, uh, Your Honor? Yes, you can ask it. All right. Uh, yeah. So, what? Uh, do you have a history with uh, Billy Thorne? Uh, Officer Maxwell? Yes. Okay. Um, with uh, do with that being him? said, do uh, police officers usually use lights and sirens in a pursuit? Yes. Um, your, your Honor, do you want me to lay back with the objections or object? Uh, object I was already I'll, objecting. I'll, 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 I think we should object questions that make sense. I don't really see how this is an objectable question outside of it may be a waste of your time. Understood. Thank you. Um, okay, I just, uh, that's, that, that's all. I just want to make sure uh, she, you know, that, that was, that, that was it for the cross for me. Thank you, Your Honor. Why didn't he ask did you have your license? Uh, Aubrey uh, Webster. Next witness. Aubrey, Aubrey Webster. Oh. Woo, forehead. Is he here? You got it. You go get him, Tiger. Oh, what's up, guys? Dingo, would you mind swearing in the witness, please? Oh, hey, what's going on? Forehead, is that you? You remember me from the Sanguine War? It's me, Dingle. I'm a judge now. And do you swear to tell the fucking truth? So help you, King Glamesh. Otherwise, the wrath of Vingle shall be bestowed upon you. All right. He's been sworn in, Your Honor. Thank you very much, Dingle. What, one moment, Your Honor, if if I may. How much time do you need? Who is this guy? 